Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome everybody to another episode of my 100% walkthrough of Fallout 4. Today, we're going to finish up helping the Minutemen, and then we're going to turn in a few quests. Now, to get the Old Guns quest... You're going to have to go to another settlement, like Sanctuary or Red Rocket, sleep for a couple days, turn on Radio Freedom, and you should hear Ronnie come over the Radio Freedom and tell you about coming back to the castle. Just giving everybody a heads up on how I got this quest. Hey there. Ah, there you are. Finally. I've been waiting to talk to you. You must be Ronnie Shaw, from the radio. Well, who else would I be? Can't mistake me for one of those pups you got running things around here. Yeah, I used to be with the Minutemen myself. Back before Joe Becker got himself killed and the idiots took over. Joe Becker? Who's that? That's just sad. General Becker used to run the Minutemen. The last real leader we ever had. After he died, there wasn't anybody left with the guts and brains to pull things together. What do you actually want? Heard you were trying to get the Minutemen back on their feet. Thought I'd come see the new general for myself. So what's your story? What makes you think anybody even wants the Minutemen back? The Commonwealth needs the Minutemen. People are starting to realize that. I've heard some good things. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Now that I'm here, I can see you really need my help. Are you offering to rejoin? I guess I am, but first things first. I'm probably the only one who still remembers this, but the castle's armory was located in the West Bastion. All of our best equipment was stored in there. Weapons, ammo, schematics, you name it. Come on, I'll show you. Ah, good. Looks like it might still be intact. Door still sealed. Bastion hasn't collapsed. Trick now is finding a way in. Do you know some way to open this door? No. And even if we could blast it open, we'd probably destroy what's inside while we're at it. If you can't go through, go around. Let's have a look at the northeast bastion. We're just going to follow Ronnie. While we're following her, I'm going to turn go. this off. That just recruits people. It's not turning off the radio. Or maybe it is. I don't know. I know it recruits people, and we don't want to recruit any more people here. I'm just so hungry. All the time. This was the general's quarters. Used to be a tunnel leading from here to the armory. Wow, well, looky here. You've already cleared it. Good job. Let's get down there and see if there's still a way through. We want to be very careful. There are a ton of of mines on the floor and Ronnie Shaw can uh, set them off and cause you a death which sucks it's happened to me plenty of times especially when I've ran through here early in the game we're just gonna grab the bags of cement I don't want to pick up the um, cannonballs they're pretty heavy I thought there was another one. No, oh, I guess not. It's over. Oh yeah, there is another. I'm such a doofus. Okay, Ronnie. I was going somewhere. Go 
grab that mine up. There's a fusion core. A chem station if you need to use it. But more importantly, we're coming up to an enemy. Here in just a second. Over with. Damn. Now he's just starting to have fun. There we go. Too bad Sarge went haywire. He's been guarding the castle since uh, forever, as far as I know. Ah, let's see. I used to know this password. One if I land. Nah, that's not it. For the Commonwealth. Ah, darn it. Oh, it's been a long time. United we stand. Yeah, that was it. Ah, that explains all the landmines. This is, well, was, General McGann. He had your job back when I first joined up. Must have gotten trapped down here when that sea beast attacked the castle. Ah, he did manage to keep the armory secure. I'll give him that much. Ah, guess the uniform is yours now, if you want it. This old geezer doesn't need it anymore. Rest in peace, General. Your fight is done, and the Minutemen live on. There's no point in getting all sentimental about something that happened 40 years ago. Come on, we're almost through. Okay, here we are. Ah, uh, let's see if this still opens from here. There we go. Told you I'd get us in here. Now, let's see what kinds of goodies are left. Excellent. The armory's still intact. Everything we need just waiting for us. And the cream of the crop. Schematics for building artillery. I have to admit, Ronnie, having artillery would help out quite a bit. Oh, we used to rain down fire on death claws and super mutants alike. It was a glorious thing. All right, grab that schematic and let's get going. Don't forget to grab some smoke grenades, too. Grab all this stuff, and then loot here, and we're going to talk to Ronnie Shaw again. <clears throat> ah, looks like you've got everything we need. As soon as you get some artillery built, we'll do a test fire to calibrate it. Let's go to the workbench. I want to store this cement in the workbench so it's not um, over-encumbering me. Um, oh, I could just do this. Let's build two artillery. Well, I'll, we'll just build one. Now, should I? Yeah, let's build two. It's pretty cool when you build two. This is probably one of my favorite parts um, about the Minutemen. They get artillery, and if you have artillery at every um, settlement in the game, you can legit just rain 
<laughs> fucking, I guess as Ronnie would say, fire down on people. You, you just bomb anywhere. It's, it's fucking fun. Especially when you beat the game and you're just like, yeah, what to do? Well, you know, just start bombing some shit. There's somebody. We got to run around here and find people to put on the artillery. Because they don't man themselves. We'll talk to Ronnie in just a second. She's a pretty cool character too. Crabby, but she's cool. She's cool, man. Now let's go talk to Ronnie. Hey. Ah, oh, gosh darn, it's good to see artillery here again. So here's the thing about the big guns. They can't fire at anything too close, but their range is impressive. That's what the smoke grenades are for. Toss one of those at the bad guys. If we have artillery in range, we'll confirm over the radio and target our fire on your smoke. But first, we better do a test fire. Make sure we're hitting what we're aiming at. You see that little building over there? We'll use that for our aiming point. Keep your radio on and tuned to Radio Freedom so we can confirm we're ready. All right, General, if you can hear me, we're ready. Toss one of those smoke grenades into the target area and we'll start the test fire. Okay, we've got your smoke on the target. You might want to stand back, yeah, you know, just in case. If we watch, we can see the artillery actually moving. It's pretty cool. Damn, blew a car up. If you have four pieces of artillery going at the same time, it can be devastating. Don't be in the vicinity, though. Artillery support. Use it wisely, General. Let's turn off the radio freedom. We don't need it anymore. We're going to go out the back. Um, or maybe this is the en entryway. I'm not really sure where the front of this fort is to where the exit is 
I guess it's completely up to you. But we're going to go this way. That's what we're going to do. We're going to head to University Point to get a legendary weapon and to get a magazine. We're just going to collect a few magazines while we're over here. That way we don't have to backtrack later. And then we're going to turn in the side quests that we have in Diamond City and in Good Neighbor. University Point is right here to our left. I have some dead raiders here. Huh, interesting. Oh, Pikmin. <laughs> Pikmin still murdering raiders. I mean, we did let him go. We didn't kill him. We're going to have a few cents in here. Nothing we can't handle. You must be terminated. <coughs> Sustaining. That's how we do things around here. There's another one over here. Somewhere over here. You must die now. There we go. Eyes on my back. Now that's what I call a confirmed kill. No more. We're going to go to the top here. We're gonna have another synth. Movement, you must die. Yeah, you didn't really stand a chance, bud. And then let's pick up the Tesla Science. Yes. Oh man, I love comics. See, even he calls them comics. You can get out through that door if you want, but we're just gonna go back downstairs. Maybe. McCready? Don't you dare. Let's go outside. It's raining. I don't know what it is, but I always love rain and fallout. Let's uh, hack the terminal. Hacking this terminal allows us to get into this door to the university credit union. Turn that radio off. We gotta hack another terminal. Doesn't change than having to look over your shoulder. Let's uh, lockpick this master safe. Nice. And we have a button in here. If we press it, it opens up this false wall. And we get yes. the prototype. Up 77 or UP 77. Either way. Either way, I think it's UP-77.
Let's go back outside. Now let's continue making our way towards Diamond City. We're going to take out these raiders real quick. That way we don't have to deal with them as we're walking by. Where'd he go? There he is. Okay, that looked like it hurt. Grab some grenades. Come out here. We're gonna go to this road and we're gonna take a right and go down the road. I want some of this hub flower first though. We're gonna get to a military checkpoint. Grab another magazine. This is going to be guns and bullets. Opening fire. <laughs> By the way, I do know that there is a cap stash in the um, vault that we were just in, that we got the prototype weapon. I just didn't feel like I needed to pick it up. <laughs> I probably should have showed everybody. But I mean, at this point, everybody should have a pretty decent amount of caps. Perfect. My goodness, I don't know what's going on. But yeah. There's our guns and bullets magazine, by the way. Safe to lockpick if you want. It's master. So it's completely up to you. If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. Let's go down the road a little more. Last video, we went down that way. This time, we're going to go this way. We've been by this red rocket, by the way, as well. Up another kill for me. Damn it, man. He came out of nowhere. Oh, I forgot that they explode. I should know better. Oh my goodness. Everything's blowing up around me. Help. I need an adult. Big John's we've been by as well. I think this is Big John's junkyard. We went through this when we were heading to save Kent um, from Sinjin. I mean, we went by it. We didn't go through it. That's what I meant to say. But you know, me and words. We don't really get along, apparently. Super Mutant Hound. Just trying to make it over here. Being shot at by a ton of different I Super Mutants. Super Mutant. I am Is that right? <laughs> I love how he's like, I am not, or I am unstoppable. Ugh, and dies like almost immediately. <laughs> yeah, oh, and he's a legendary. Yeah, we want to be careful because one of the super mutants has a minigun. And that is no fun. Let's say let's stay topped off. 
health-wise, that is. They're everywhere. They're multiplying. It's terrifying. Not really. Let's try not to die here. Gary. Um, excuse me, sir. I was busy killing your friends. Wasn't there a legendary around here? Is that the legendary? Yep, that's the legendary. I was like, I know there's a legendary around here somewhere. My god, they're everywhere. Oh my god. All right, well we just threw our artillery. Um, let's hurry up. Cuz I really don't want to be over here when the artillery starts going off. That was a Homer moment for me. I don't know where they are. To pick up Tales of a Junk Town Jerky Vendor, oh, man, we only those. have two more whoa, to whoa, get. Whoa. It's crazy how many, uh, yep, there we go. I knew it was coming. That was really stupid of me. <laughs> Let's get the fuck up out of here. Seriously, though. We should be alright to stand up and get our asses out of there <laughs> before we die. Just heal ourselves, just in case. Coming over here to the railroad tracks, if you want, you can go down that way. Uh, it's highly irradiated, so use some Radix. Just a forewarning there. Huh. Interesting. I think this is an event spot as well. Oh. Just starting to have fun. Cool. Scared me. Caught me off guard. We're almost to Diamond City now. And then we'll go turn in those quests. Or, well, qu yeah, they're quests. Even though they're side quests, they're still quests, man. Come down here, go to the road. We're gonna hang a right and just follow this road straight down till it dead ends to this like junkyard kind of thing or whatever it is. Hang a left and we're at Diamond City. That easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Go inside Diamond City. I haven't been to Diamond City in years, but I'll tell you, nothing's changed. Oh my goodness, look at those textures. Beautiful. <laughs> oh man, that's something else. Let's talk to Nat. Selling papers is busy work, mister. Nat. Hey mister, that interview you did with Piper is really selling. Here's your free copy. You and your mercenary beautiful. Frank keep your Hairstyles guns in your tents. The Got something green for me, man? And by green, I mean mutated and glowing. Found the plant. Here you go. All right. Here's your payment, plus some samples from the pharmacy. Don't take them all at once now. Moderation. Anyway, I got a store to run. Let's talk shop. I don't need anything. Let me know if that changes. Let's put a level in.
Put it into perception. Don't let the stress of life kill you. Relax with some Kim. If you need a haircut, talk to John at the Super Salon. Hey, Mo. Any luck getting those relics? Well, the future of baseball could depend on them. Got them all right here. I like your gumption. Let me take a look. Oh, this baseball. It's the real deal. You'd sign one of these and give it to the children of anyone you killed on the field. Oh, look at that card. Oh, see those numbers on the back? Tracks the count of enemies beaten to death by the player. Check out the leather on that mitt. Ah, really good players use them to catch bullets. True fact there. That's everything on the list. Uh, thank you. Far as I'm concerned, you're now a part of baseball collector history. Let's make our way to Abbott, turn in this green paint. You're back. You find that paint? Wasn't easy, but I found some, yeah. Now that's damn fine news. Why don't you go ahead and paint the first stroke? Let's see how the shade matches up. Working hard? Mmm, that's a good shade of green. The wall sure seems happy with it. Happy to help. It's been an honor. It's nice to work with someone who knows how to show respect. There's your payment, and a little bonus for getting the right shade of green. Don't do anything with it I wouldn't do. Whatever, old man. Let's fast travel to Good Neighbor. I heard you walk that freedom trail. What, you some kind of, what do they call it? History buff? You ever tried chess? Sometimes you need to sacrifice a piece to keep the game going. Keep that in mind. How's my little scout doing? You find out what's happening at Pikmin Gallery? Let's just say Pikmin's art isn't going to have much resale value once all those bodies start decaying. <laughs> well, they say all artistic inspiration is ephemeral, am I right? Wish I could say that was the most twisted thing I've ever heard of, but it ranks up there. Top three. I'll put the word out. Tell people to stay clear of that area. Hiring you is definitely one of my better moments. Here, spend the money in good health. We didn't get to the top of this town by playing it fair. Let's go to the Hotel Rexford. Greetings, new friends. I am the Rufus. What buddy, the heck is this but thing? You can just it's that cooling machine I was buddy. telling you about. I am here to provide entertainment and oh, my skull libations. Awesome. I'm going to store my vodka. Just in get this it thing. set up over at the bar and out of my doorway. Commencing normal operations. Rufus. Hey, thanks for your help. It's even better than I was hoping for. Here's your money. You're back! How was hallucinogen? Find me something good. <laughs> I think I found a drug that even you'd think twice about huffing. That's so. Far out. Can't wait to start breaking this down in the lab. Here's your payment. In full. As promised. Hey, before you head out, you need to pick me up? Buff out? Mentats? Not now. Hey, no worries. Next time, huh? Good to see you. Let's go outside and end the video. We'll go in front of the memory den and uh, end the video. The memory den looks really cool anyway, so why not, right? All right, everybody. I want to thank you all for stopping by. 
If you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to, to subscribe. And like always, everybody, have a great morning, a great afternoon, or a great night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.